Hello everyone and welcome to today's video where we are going to talk about how to create a zero grazing unit. So first and foremost we are going to discuss about the layout of a small zero grazing unit. First of all you will need a store where you can store feed and milk temporarily. You can have a larger store away from the unit but you have a small store where you store milk temporarily before you transport it to to the market or before you store it somewhere else then you have the store you can also use it to store feed then you need to have a milking place or a milking parlor where you used to milk the animals then you'll also need a sleeping cubicle the minimum space for a sleeping cubicle is 1.2 meters by 2.1 meters then you will also need a place for where you can place the calf pen where a young calf is placed and the minimum space for a calf pen is 1.2 meters by 1.5 meters then you will need a feeding area that is exposed to the sun all the areas I've mentioned before can be shaded but the feeding area needs to be exposed to the sun then the roof that you use to construct for your zero grazing unit must have a minimum of three meters high oh, just a then when doing zero grazing units a gable roof is always better than a single pitched roof then in case you tend to use iron mats especially in the tropics where there is hot temperatures you can use woven mats you can use woven mats to reduce the temperature then for the sleeping air areas or the sleeping cubicles you need to introduce bedded sheds of straw or sawdust so that your animals are comfortable when they sleep then another important thing that you can note is that the zero grazing unit has an should have an alleyway that allows you to call to collect manure and urine which you can then use to make biogas this all that i've discussed above is sufficient for a small zero grazing unit but in case you need to house large herds of dairy cattle you'll need additional space such as large resting areas for your cows then you may need an exercise yard a large yard where your cows can go to exercise then you'll need a larger feeding area than the one you see on the on the on the house above then you'll need a large milk collecting center or a large milk store then you'll need more more calving pens than the one above then apart from the store you'll also need to have another bulk store another bulk feed store where you can store your hay silage and concentrates then you may also need an isolation pen for cows that are sick then you may need manure storage area you may need additional offices offices if you are employing if you are employing a, a manager to to manage your zero grazing farm that's all for today see you in the next video